Hi everyone, this is Kathy Grosskirk with Bookkeeping Clean and Simple and I want to show you how to update the timeout settings in your QuickBooks Online file. And I usually do this with every client file that I work with and if you are a firm owner that is working with QuickBooks Online, kind of a DIY deal, you want to make sure you do this yourself. So as you can see, I'm in the Kathy's Bookkeeping Test file here. And what we want to do to update this setting is we're going to go over here to the big gear icon. And we're, or they call that the grid gear. We're going to go ahead and click on it. Go over here under your company. Go to account and settings. I'm going to wait for that to load. And when that loads, we're going to go all the way down here to the very bottom to the advanced tab. Scroll all the way down to the bottom, and as you can see under the other preferences areas where we're going to do this change. Now, I've already done this to this file because I do it, like I say, every time I get a new client file or any time I'm working within a realm, you can do this within a realm as well. You want to make sure you go down here to the very bottom. It's going to say sign me out if inactive for, and it's going to have a default of one hour. So if you need to go ahead and update this, there's one of two ways you can do this. You can either go ahead and click on the pencil icon to open that up, or you can just go ahead and click right here and that will open that up. So as you can see, you have a drop down here that you can click on and the maximum you can do is three hours. And I suggest you do it for the three hours. And let's say we're doing this for the first time, you would actually go over here and click on save. And that will update that in here and then make, and of course it's going to take its time to do the update here. So anyway, once you do that, you go back down here, make sure that three hours is what you have it set for. Then you can go ahead and click on done to get out of here. And that'll take you back to where you were before. So that way, you don't have to worry about when you're working in a client file and you get called away to do something or you want a phone call longer than you need to be and it doesn't time out for inactivity while you're in the middle of a transaction or doing something major. So anyway, that's all I have for you today. I hope this helps you. Y'all take care now and we will see you soon. Thank you for watching. I would love it if you would subscribe to my channel and share it with others. My goal is to publish at least one new video per week on QuickBooks desktop or online topics, the occasional motivational video, and a few surprises thrown in here and there. I would love to talk to you about how to help you optimize your knowledge and usage of QuickBooks desktop or online. My Calendly link is in the slide. Please use that to reach out to me to schedule a free 45-minute initial consult. I would love to talk to you about your QuickBooks desktop or online training needs. Again, have a wonderful day and until next time, we'll see you soon. Take care.